Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming. I'm Brianna White and today we're going to be playing through some more Final Fantasy VII Remake Intermission, the Yuffie DLC, and we are a little bit past, maybe a little bit more than a little bit past the halfway point. So we're getting close to the end. Things are starting to heat up. It's going to be a great episode today. I hope you're excited. Take a second to like the video before I begin and we'll get on to the gameplay. Enjoy! We're good on bench. Let's see, ooh, boxes to smash, good stuff. Definitely smash the boxes, always. And yes, totally agree, Scarlet's voice actress is amazing. Where are amazing. We? That thing can't be operational, can it? It can be, I hope not, boss. but I do hope not. At long last, Wu Tai's finest deign to join us. <laughs> You've performed admirably. Quit acting all superior. We both know you're afraid of us. <laughs> Is that so? Well, maybe I am. You should know there's more where we came from. Lots more. And you'll never see them coming. Just imagine a whole clan of ninjas landing on your doorstep. <laughs> oh my! We must do something right away. Well, you can't. Don't say that. Won't you at least give us a chance? Oh, Scarlet herself, huh? The latest innovation in Shinra Battle Armor. Designed by yours truly. We stopped the last stream right before a big boss battle. This will be a memory to cherish for the rest of your lives. All 30 seconds of them. Oh no! Don't bullet barrage me! No, I don't want to be dead already. No, no, wait, what is that? Oh, we gotta get rid of that. Hello. Okay, so we've defeated some sentry rays. I think we should get an assess going here because I want to know what we're in for. Uh, I mean... I assume the Crimson Mare is the, like, machine. So, okay. Weak to lightning. That's good. I think we still have lightning equipped. Blood red battle armor for Scarlet's personal use. Its creator's personality can be seen of every facet of this machine, from its extravagantly outfitted cockpit that emphasizes form over function to its arms oversized weapons loadout. When its pilot is incapacitated, it will be susceptible to staggering. It is capable of equipping a variety of lethal artillery, but destroying these weapons will temporarily eliminate the threat they pose. So then we have to make a choice here, right away, of who to focus, because it seems like we can focus our ATB on Scarlet, the pilot, the like Crimson Mare, or the weapons. And to be honest, I don't know what the right choice is. I do like the susceptible to staggering, but we won't be able to build stagger very quickly if we're constantly taking damage. So I kind of am wondering maybe destroy the weapons first? Because it was the right call, whoa, to destroy the sentry rays. Flame Spire, I don't know, oh, Sonon. Just don't be dying over there so quickly. Okay, immediately we're on the defensive. We're gonna cure a Yuffie. And maybe Sonon, who has full ATB right now, can do Swirling Storm. Nope, we can't focus any weapons right now. Just the Crimson Mare or Scarlet. So we're gonna do Scarlet. We're gonna go to hopefully stagger this machine. But I can only like focus on Scarlet. Oh no, I have locked on Scarlet right now. Okay, so we're gonna get an Art of War going on Scarlet and we'll just see what that gets us. Not Flame Spire. Don't Flame Spire me. I'm gonna run from that. Bullet Barrage. Directive deploy. Deploy what? No, 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 don't deploy those, no. All right, how quickly can I knock you out? All right, pretty quickly. But we need a Cura real quick. 
Kira on Yuffie. Sonon's full on ATB, so we're gonna do a Swirling Storm on Scarlet. And we're gonna start taking out these Sentry Launchers, and we're just gonna keep running. Okay, Bullet Barrage on Yuffie. Maybe, oh, let's get a Lightning Ninjutsu going. Sonon has an ATB. I think we're gonna use an item, like maybe a Mega on Yuffie. Save some of that MP for a Lightning thing. Yeah, okay. All right, where are we at? There's one more sentry launcher. We're gonna get that down quick. Run away from whatever attack Scarlet's doing. Okay, We've got a bullet barrage coming at me. We're taking some damage, but we do have a thunderish banishment too. So I think, actually, I wonder if we can focus the Machine versus the Scarlet. Is Scarlet weak to fire like people are? Maybe we'll save Thunder as Banishment until we have the answer for that. So if I press Assess again, can I assess Scarlet? Yes. Okay, so Scarlet, the director of Shinra's Advanced Weaponry Division. She has taken command of the battle armor she herself designed so as to torture and put an end to her unwitting test subjects. When her HP is depleted, she will faint and be unable to pilot the battle armor. Great. Weak to fire, just like I thought. So maybe instead, if we're targeting Scarlet first, we equip Fire Ninjutsu instead. No Flame Spire, no Flame Spire. No, 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 no. Okay, we're gonna use Akira and then switch to, um, we're not gonna use Akira because Okay, now we're gonna use a Cura. And that's gonna get us only half the way, but I'm okay with that. Yuffie's MP is almost down. No flame spire. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. I gotta learn to see that attack ahead of time. Sonon's got an ability, so we're gonna use a Mega Potion on Yuffie. Okay, we've got an ATB, so we're gonna switch to Fire Ninjutsu. We're gonna target Scarlet. Sonon has limit break. We're gonna use it on Scarlet. Yuffie has Art of War. She has Fiery Banishment 3. We're gonna also use it on Scarlet. We're just really going for it here. Love, 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 love. Wait, she was supposed to faint. She was supposed to faint. Not a phase two, no! We overused our abilities! Okay, now we gotta switch back to lightning and get those Mako cannons down. Sonon will use an item. We'll use a mega potion on self and good. Okay, Yuffie's got her limit break now. Do we limit break on the Mako Cannon, or Scarlet, or the Crimson Mare. I think the Crimson Mare, and if the Mako Cannons happen to take damage, that's fantastic. Let's just go for it. Oh, we should have switched to Lightning first. Oh well. I don't know if it really matters, but. Okay. Lock on, lock on, okay. Okay, Sonon. Okay, so let's switch to Lightning. Ninjutsu. Okay, switch to Lightning. I really want to get those Mako Cannons down. I can barely see anything! Oh, Yuffie, no! Oh, God. Okay, um... We'll do a cure because it's quick. Oh, Sonon's casting auto cure right now. Okay, let's just let that go through then. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, now Yuffie can cast Cura with hopefully not dying. Whoa, Sonon took that hit for us. Thank you. Okay, right, Mako Cannon's almost down. Okay. 
Left. Okay, Art of War on the left Mako Cannon. Almost down. Okay. As soon as we get the Crimson Mare staggered, we're gonna limit or summon. But in the meantime, should we synergize? Do a synergized Art of War on, okay, so let's switch to Fire and then we'll do a synergized Art of War on Scarlet. Another phase. But, uh, man, this game has a thing for the phases, huh? Oh, good, you got a little sword now. A little is not exactly the right word. And we just switched to fire. Okay. <sighs> choices, 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 choices. The Claymore is... Uh, I think it's gonna be weak to lightning, but let's switch to lightning and find out. I just, I wanna play defensively here. Rocket launcher, sounds good. Seems like Sonon's gonna take all of that. We're gonna use an Art of War on, on the Claymore. Okay, we're almost there. We're just spamming right now. Cause she's not moving, so I'm like, let's just spam it. Okay. We have Scarlet or the Crimson Mare to choose from. It looks like the shield is still up. The shield, I don't know what it's weak to. So I'm just gonna use a Thunderous Banishment on it. No, I'm not gonna use a big ability if I don't know what it's weak to. So let's just use Art of War. Okay, that doesn't seem to be doing enough. So I'm gonna skip the shield. I'm gonna switch to Fire Ninjutsu. We're on phase three, so I pray that that's gonna be okay. Now we need to build some ATB, so we're gonna focus on Scarlet. Okay, all right, running away. We're gonna synergize. We're gonna use an Art of War. Synergize Art of War on Scarlet. Staggered, yes! Okay, summon time. Oh, you're still doing your thing. Okay, do your thing, do your thing. Okay, now summon time. An insufficient ATB. Okay, build some ATB real quick. Meanwhile, we're gonna use uh uh We have plenty of ether. I don't know. Sonon, I don't know what to do with you yet. You know what? Just go for a Thundara on it. I don't know what the shield is weak to, so yeah, just while it's staggered, get a Thundara in there. One. Yuffie, what, what is her ATB doing? What? She got stuck. Did you see that? Her ATB was like, burp, 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 burp. why did that happen? The heck? The weirdest thing I've ever seen. Another phase. I'm never going to get this summon out. Ever. Okay. Oh, let's get a cure out while we're here. We want a cure, uh, actually. And then Sonon, actually, I want to use an ether on Yuffie. Woo, we ran from that right in time. Okay, now we want to be back to lightning, don't we? You know what? Let's just use our summon. Let's just use it. We spend so much time saving for, like, the most efficient thing, but just, like, get it out there, man. We're going to go for another phase anyway. Let's get Rama up in here. Come on, Rama. Mess her up. Summon abilities, Voltaic Lance. Let's use a Voltaic Lance on the right Mako Cannon. You know what? Mm, on the Crimson here. Okay, then we're gonna switch to, you know what? We're gonna switch to Lightning Nuzutsu and we're just gonna try and take out the Crimson here like completely. Sonon has an ATB. So Sonon can actually use Voltaic Lance on the Crimson Mirror. And then that leaves Yuffie open to run. I mean, we did run. Um, and use a Thunderous Banishment 3, which we've been holding on to on the Crimson Mare. It's not staggered, but it did actually a lot of damage. So we'll take it. Rocket Launcher. 
Zonon's gonna take all of that for us, which is fantastic. Use another summon ability. We'll take Lance on the Crimson Mare. Zonon has an ability, so we're gonna use Swirling Storm. It's almost down, but we're gonna run. Oh, we're good. Nailed it. Woo! Not bad. Actuators weren't up to the task. Time for an overhaul. Hello. <laughs> my, my, my. How the tables have turned. She doesn't seem that concerned. <laughs> oh, the villain laugh. Classic. Proud of yourself, little savage. <laughs> what are you doing? She's not gonna blow herself up. No, no. Okay, that's not what that was. No, I literally. What is happening? is a surprise. To what do I owe the pleasure? <laughs> These idiots want to digitally replicate me, so I'm indulging them. I'll say. Transporting. I am along for this ride because I have no idea what's going on. Chadley? Shinra learn. There is no replicating you. They ought to know better. <laughs> Looking forward to this. I am. Uh, it has been too long since my last hunt. Okay. So, uh, she didn't blow herself up. Do? I thought that's what that was Toss. for a second. But clearly she just activated it's done in Wu -Tai. something. You just howl until you get what you want. That's enough, Sonon. I got this. All right, lady, out with it. Tell us where you're hiding the new materia. Don't play dumb now. We know you've been cooking up something super powerful. Well, well. Wu Tai must have some highly skilled intelligence operatives. That or we have a mole in our midst. What was? I'll check on it. All right, but make it quick. You are correct that we're in the process of creating an exquisite new materia. However, it is far from complete. Yeah, right. You must think I'm stupid. Would I lie to you? Yes. Regrettable though it is, other plans have been deemed a higher priority. What other plans? <laughs> well, just between you and me, my colleagues and I are going to drop plate number seven on the slums. And then we're going to blame it on Avalanche and Wutai. I don't get it. You're gonna drop a plate? And? Oh dear. I think your friend might have run into trouble. Aren't you going to save him? <laughs> Quickly now. <laughs> Ooh, that lighting on that villain laugh. So good. Look, lady. I'm not happy with you. <laughs> what are you waiting for? Better but hurry. I want to hear what you have to say. <laughs> what are you Seems for? like that's it. Going to smash some boxes first. Am I gonna smash these box? Okay, I guess I'm gonna smash them one kick at a time. Where's my boomerang? All right, I don't I think we're supposed to smash these boxes, but I don't know, they're here, so I'm doing it anyway. I don't even know when these boxes showed up. They don't have anything in them, so like, 
Are they just for decor? Like... <laughs> what is the point of these boxes? I understand that this is like a very intense story moment and I'm supposed to be making my way downtown to save Sonon, but... I have to smash the boxes. But anyways, um... That's not the door we're supposed to be exiting from. Sonon! Saving Sonon! Here we go. Can we smash these boxes with our boomerang? Okay, I don't know what the difference was. Won't happen again. There is no ultimate materia. Not yet. She said it's still in the works. And she mentioned something else. Gonna drop plate number seven. They're gonna do what? They're gonna drop plate number seven on the slums. Apparently. I feel like that's the part of the sector. They already Wait. knew that, Did didn't they? Yes! This is bad. Did they think he was joking? That honestly, the writing of that is a little bit confusing to me personally because I'm like. And we can't afford to let it die with us. GJ already said that to them. Like, why would they think he was joking about that? Did they just need a way to say it twice? I'm confused. Anyways, so we're gonna be at half health already. So let's just have Sonon use Athira on these soldiers because they're kind of grouped up. So maybe it'll get multiple of them. Who knows? Meanwhile, we've got some eight bound. Who's bound? Me, I'm bound. Who's bound? What is this? Rude. All right, Yuffie's gonna have to do some curaing Peronto. So we're gonna do some curaing. Sonon is provoking, which is who are we? What, what's happening here? All right, so I'm gonna actually use a mega potion on Yuffie because we've got the ATB and we are taking kind of a lot of damage here. Yeah, I would love for Sonon to focus one person. So I'm actually gonna have Sonon do the one person targeting a single enemy fighting spirit on, let's pick one. I pick B. I feel like B, it's your time to die. I, meanwhile, am going to equip fire ninjutsu because these are human enemies and we're just going to... Why are we unfocusing on him? Where's B? Did he die? No, he's still very much alive. That's weird. Is it like a feature of these enemies that you can't focus them? It's kind of weird. I guess we'll just use a fiery banishment on soldier. Yeah, look. So you can't see because my camera's in the way, but deep ground soldier A is like grayed out right now. Like I can't focus them. So I don't know, maybe like one of their abilities is you're constantly switching attention. I don't know. I haven't figured it out yet. But fiery banishment seemed to work great actually. And we're bound again. Ooh, this little hand-to-hand -hand combat moment is actually kind of cool. Sonon has a limit break. I'd love to use that, um, but we really do need a very quick heal. So, because I don't want Sonon to die in the middle of this limit break, but I don't think that's gonna happen. So, okay, Soldier A has less health. We're gonna focus on Soldier A. And then Yuffie is going to Cura Sonon and also get the benefits. And then dodge the pyro shot. We didn't dodge it, but that's okay. Uh, so Yuffie's gonna use Art of War on Soldier C because A is gonna die from Dance of the Dragon. And where you go? Where'd you go? Here, you did some like little like, gone invisible kind of thing. And then Sonon, I don't know why his name is red right now. Well, he maybe has like a debuff on him or something, but we're gonna use a high potion on him because we've got the ATB. Yeah, he went unfocused here. There we go. All right, and that's the end of you, sir. And our material leveled up. Cleansing. Ooh, it's a fun little cutscene. Look at this. Let 
Dang, Zonon. Just crush that guy's sternum. <laughs> That's Yuffie's motivation. She's like, I can't die yet. The happy turtle is calling my name. Ooh, not a grenade. Why do they seem okay that we're in here? Somehow, I seriously doubt it. So where are we? Oh, man, I so don't want to go back out there. But I don't think we've got a choice. But what is this room that we're in? That is where we just, ooh, a bench. Hello, my friend. I will, I will indeed sit on the bench. Let's take a little snoozer here. Let's take a little break. Just a little tiny break. A momentary break. Okay, HP and MP fully restored. That's what we like to see. And there's some stuff on sale. We're gonna buy it all. If we can afford it. Yes. Good. Ethers are sold out. Oh, but we can get these ethers. Uh, we have, you know, we ended up using more mega potions than ethers, so we're just gonna use as many mega potions. Okay, we can only afford one. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, and now we're super broke. Fantastic. So here's the thing. UV has the boomerang currently equipped because it has the most materia. Oh my gosh, we have this whole materia we never use. Ninja Cannonball with R1 and Triangle while synergized. Okay, we just gotta remember to use that. Here's the thing about some of these very special, super powerful OP materials. You have to remember to use them. And that's my weakness, friends. I'm pretty good with the ATB. Very good with spamming attacks. Not so good with remembering R1 triangle combos. Or what, or what the guarding button is. I never remember that one. I'm pretty sure it's R1, but who's to say? <laughs> huh. Anyways, um, we like literally don't ever use chakra. So I do not know why we have it here. Um, when we could, if we're not going to use it, use like prayer instead. Because here's the thing. I like chakra over prayer in some circumstances because chakra is a is a heal and a debuff removal. However, it only heals yourself and we're more often than not we have cure attached to magnify because we need to heal both at the same time. So why even level chakra when we could just be leveling prayer instead and heal both of them at the same time. So let's just say, forget it. Forget about it. Okay, what's this Firebird amulet? So an elegant piece of armor touched by the saving grace of an undying feathered creature. Avoid incapacitation once per battle. Incapacitation, does that mean fainting or does that mean being bound? Does not work against instant death attacks. Instant death attacks? How many of those are there? Or when HP is at one. So incapacitation seems like fainting. Okay. So the Firebird holds the same amount of materia, has much more defense, but doesn't level your AP twice as fast. So I really, really like the Ninja Armlet for leveling my Materia, but uh, I'm tempted. I am actually tempted to use this. Maybe actually Sonon should have it. Let's see, what's Sonon got going on right now? A bracer manufactured by... By Shinra for its elite troops. So he has a lot of physical defense right now. 
So if we wanted to, we could. How often does Sonon die though? It's usually Yuffie that dies and then Sonon sacrifices himself to bring Yuffie back up. So I don't know if that, I just don't think this Firebird thing is very useful for Sonon. I do like that it has more magic defense. It's more of a balanced defense, which I do like. And this has no additional bonuses at all. So let's put the Firebird on Sonon. I, not so much for the incapacitation avoidable thing, but really more for the more balanced defense stats. And it has the same amount of materia slots. So, okay, it looks like we have a little bit more upgrading we can do. So we're going to do that real quick. And then the question I have is, Yuvi's not really our magic caster. She does use Cura. But I wonder if she wouldn't do better with. OK, you know what, Brianna, you said the words and then you forgot that you said them. We don't have the boomerang equipped because we like its stats the best. We have the boomerang equipped because it has the most materia slots. However. However, let's take a look at. If we were to upgrade her shuriken, if we could get more materia slots, and then maybe it will be a weapon we like better. Okay, so let's just skip right ahead to the new materia slots, because that's going to give a new materia slot, and then this is going to link them. Do we have another materia slot hiding somewhere? We do. Okay. Okay. Give it another materia slot in there. Okay. We can even do another materia slot. We could have more materia. Oh. Okay. So then what does Bloodsucker do? Recover HP when enemies are defeated in battle. Yes. Okay. Steel six attack damage boost, attack power plus four. Six, 12, aerial attack damage, attack power plus six. Okay, so this is our, let's do an attack power plus six. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What if we also did magic attack power plus six? What's six plus two? Twelve. So we could get another attack power plus three and magic attack power plus three. Attack power plus three and magic attack power plus three. Or we can do one magic attack power plus six. I think the other way. Let's do this. Let's do attack power plus three and magic attack power plus three. Yes. Good. Good. So then right now, the four point shuriken has more materia slots and an additional linked materia slots than the boomerang. So we could get something fun in there. Who knows what it is going to be, but we can get something fun in there. The only thing is the boomerang has a higher magic attack power, but we don't really use magic attacks with Yuffie. So I think going with the, nope, we don't need to upgrade it. We just did that. We want to equip it. So I think going with that is going to be the better option. On the other hand, the Steel Reaper, if we were to upgrade this, we cannot add another Materia slot. We can, well, not, we, we can add another Materia slot, 
but doing so is not going to get us enough materia slots comparatively. Right. So do we do the same amount of materia slots, but higher physical damage or more materia slots and lower physical damage? While I think about that, I'm going to upgrade. Okay, we are still not proficient in Insight because he has the Provoke Materia, so we don't ever use it. Um, I guess I, I just am not, like, super worried about it. Um, because the thing about the Gin Staff is it's also a very balanced weapon, which I tend to lean more towards balance because I have a very, like, variety style. So it has a very balanced physical and magical stats. So I think I like that over the Indurate staff, which has higher physical and mm, the same amount of materia slots, or the Martialist staff, which is slightly le leaning towards physical. Because Sonon right now is a little bit more of our magic caster, because he's got the lightning materia and the fire materia. So I think, But we do want the proficiency bonus. I don't know. Let's just upgrade the weapon and see what we can get. ATB charge rate boost. I did remember wanting that, but we could also just do attack power plus six, which would not be a bad choice. That would be a great choice. Or we can do two attack power plus fives. Yes. Yes, that's what we wanted. Good. Okay. I'm not, I'm not mad about this. All right, cool. So let's equip Yuffie's. I just, we're playing Yuffie. She likes Materia. We're going to go with the one that can do the more Materia slots. That's what we're doing. Look, we can do two additional Materia. Two. Two. Wait, what is this doing in here? We never use this. We never, we never end up staggering people anymore. They're dead too quickly. Whatever. What about ATB boost? Is that what, is that what I meant to put in there? And then I didn't? <laughs> is that what I meant to put in there? Where's ATB boost? Maybe I meant to put an ATB boost. Let's see if I remember to use it. It's a mystery. The world may not be ready for my lack of anything. Okay, so if we wanted to, we could put in another magnify and put in Or we could put in HP up and MP up. Because I'm not going to use a lot of these other ones. Item Master, maybe. I, I really kind of like the idea of using a magnify on a barrier materia because then we can both have barrier or mana ward or mana wall. I did end up using a, that a lot in remake. Um, I think against the Hell House fight was very helpful because I just was taking so much damage. Hmm. But you know what? We've got two Materia slots, or HP up and MP up. I do use Yuffie's MP for Cura a lot. And we do need to Cura a lot. You know what? We're, that's what we're doing. We just, then we don't have to worry about constantly pressing random buttons or having to make too many choices when we have an ATV. We're, this is where we're going with. Okay. This is where we're going with. We like it. All right.
were fixed up. And I still don't know what this room is about. But now we've done a, a full border check here. Let's see. See, I sort of feel like this room was something other than a bench because is that literally we just walk, we walked in and now we walk back out. I don't know about that choice. Um, this room was called something. It was called the combat simulator prototype. So I guess this whole thing is the combat simulator prototype. Ah, there was something different about this room. Okay. No good. Door won't budge. Meaning we're trapped. Sensation Max. The rest I leave to you. Sensation. He's looking a little crazy there. Oh, boy. Is he, like, absorbing their essence? Simulator. ATP boost. We're using it. Look at us. We used it. We remembered to use it. Okay, now we just got to use Ninja Cannonball. Uh, okay, but first, let's get a little assess on these guys. Weak to ice, of course. Okay. Stagger gauge. Rarely get interrupted. Experimental specimens kept in Shinra's underground research facility. They were human once. But cellular transplants designed to enhance their strength have turned them into monsters. Fantastic. All right, well, let's go ahead and we could equip ice or we can just go straight for that synergize little, what was it, R1 and triangle? Let's try it, R1 and triangle. Why do I feel like that didn't do anything? R1, triangle. There we go, okay. So I vaguely remember there being something about if it lands. Uh, we've got way too much ATV here, so we're just gonna use twirling lunge on this guy, I don't know. Okay. Yeah, I figured there was more. Okay. Are you weak to ice too? They're monsters, so I feel like you would be. Let's equip ice then. Ninjutsu. Don't you dare attack me. I'm watching you. Okay, well, I told you don't you dare, and then you did it anyway. Don't you throat clamp me! No! Well, I'm gonna use my new ability on you now. Um, we're gonna synergize, wait, no. Cause it feels Sonon's, we're gonna have Sonon use the ATB first. Like, uh, yeah. Where is Yuffie not going? All right, we'll have Sonon use Swirling Storm. All 
All right, and then on you, you seem like you've got poison going on you now. So we are gonna use our little ninja cannonball ability again, because it's just kind of fun. Wait, we're not synergized. We're not synergized. No! Okay, so now we need to heal. Do we use a potion or... Okay, use a potion. And then we can use our ninja cannonball. Ninja cannonball! No, we use press the wrong button. Yeah, there we go, landed it. Does that even really do that much damage though? I have a question. Synergize Art of War, let's do it. We probably should have started with Synergize Art of War because I know it gives you like a little damage boost after you use it, so. Who's next? Oh, this light is like a border on the arena. Okay, got it. Like really confused why I was like not running. Okay. So we've got Riot Troopers, good stuff. So now it's gonna get started with a little swirling storm on our elite Grenadier there. We're gonna switch to Fire Ninjutsu. You died way too quick. So now it's leveling up over here. Yeah, this is kind of an interesting um. Woo! What are you? You're immune. Okay. What the? What is that? Okay. Well, let's maybe knock out the arm with a, I don't know, Art of War. Sonon, meanwhile, I don't know why it's saying immune. But Sonon's gonna use Fighting Spirit on that right arm. Yeah, why not? I don't know, it's saying immune. I'm not really sure what it's immune to. Now it's gone. Good. Okay, we're gonna actually use an Assess on this little projector guy. Actually, we're not, because it's not an option. We can assess the Diabolic Creation or the right arm. So let's do the Diabolic Creation, I guess. What do we got here? A man-made monstrosity created by Shinra's Research and Development Division. It has since been disposed of for its cannibalic nature and disobedience. All that remains of it is the data stored in the combat simulator. Severing its right appendage will weaken it, make it susceptible to staggering when it has enshrouded a portion of its body in mist. Attacking the affected area will cause it to counter with an explosion. Good to know. Don't attack during mist. It's another lesson from Final Fantasy XIV. Okay, but we do want to have ice equipped and... We still don't know what this projector thing is. Also, it's kind of like a weird like um, format for this battle because it's not one long prolonged battle. It's resetting my ninjutsu every single time we defeat a phase, like a like a round. So, um, kind of interesting format. Ouch! I was talking. Okay, you gotta respect that I'm a streamer. Okay, game. What's Sonon doing here? He's got a full ATB. Let's get him going on a twirling lunge. Nah, let's do Swirling Storm. No, we won't do Swirling Storm. We won't do anything because it's grayed out now. So let's wait a second. Now maybe we do Swirling Lunge? What the heck? Why is he untargetable right now? Oh, because he's in the <laughs> like, <laughs> he's in the like Shadow Realm or whatever. Okay, uh, now Sonon will uh, now Sonon will use Twirling Lunge on that. No, we're gonna use Swirling Storm on the right arm. And we're gonna dodge the Spiraga. We didn't dodge it very well. We did a bad job of that. Man, if only I had a Chakra Materia equipped right now. I'm gonna wait for the Auto Cure to go in. Then we're gonna use Cura on Yuffie. Fantastic. Is the right arm done? You're in the shadowy thing. Good, and you're gonna cast a snare on Sonon. Okay, so, we're close to a summon. Yuffie is going to, we're gonna do our little, you know what, Ninja Cannonball, because we remember R1 and Triangle. So synergize R1 Triangle. Don't 
Don't attack the mist. Don't attack the mist. Don't attack the mist. Draga and Sonon. Okay. Okay. Yeah, right arm is almost down. So we're gonna use Ice Ninjutsu because he's weak to Ice. We're gonna take out the right arm. Don't attack the mist. Don't attack the mist. He's untargetable. Okay, ensnare. Why are you saying immune to some stuff? I don't know, but Sona needs to use an item. Mega potion on Yuffie so that we can go in with a dodging. Then we can go in with an art of war on the right arm. And save an ATB for when it's squeaked to stagger. And now we're gonna use an icy banishment too. Yeah, happy with that. Now it's staggered and now it's dead. Okay, now we kill the projector with a synergized, not a synergized Art of War. Now a synergized Art of War. Yes. Interesting. So this is a big bad, actually. This projector is kind of strong. All right, well, while you're doing your thing, uh, I don't know, Let's see if I, oh, you're back up. You're back up and full health. Good, good, good. Great, well, we still have ice, which is great. So we need a Cura pretty bad. And I think since you're back up at full health, sir, I think now would be a great time to call in the heavy duty old man. We're just gonna take out that right arm. Did that strategy work for us before? We're gonna do it again. Sonon's gonna use Voltaic Lance on the right arm. I can't really figure out what it's saying it's immune to. I wonder if the right arm is not susceptible to ice. Maybe let's take ice off. Maybe let's switch to something else. I don't know. Let's, let's, oh, here's an idea. Let's see if we can get, someone's down. Oh, we need a little bit of cure in here. Dodging, uh, trying to at least, ineffective. Why did Sonon like grab us there? Bad at this. Why does he keep like, is he like trying to be a body shield? He keeps grabbing us. Okay, here's the right arm. We're gonna die. We're gonna use an item. We're gonna mega potion ourselves. Sonon is going to use Voltaic Lance on that right arm. Tensor pull. Ooh, woo, 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 woo. Pain, pain and suffering. Okay, let's just use a limit break on the right arm. Go for it. Hey, we've got the right arm. Now it's just pressured. Uh, let's, we're just gonna keep going. I know I could take damage and that would be bad. Are we frogs right now? Are we literally toads right now? Well, what am I supposed to do with that? Can, I can't do anything. All I can leapfrog. Frogs right now, love it. Okay, we're back, we're back, we're back. Okay, use a banishment two on this diabolic creation. Yes, good, 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 good. And then Rama would do like a final ability because he's almost out. We have to heal ourselves for sure. We got plenty of MP, so we're gonna cure us. There we go. Rama's like, you're out of here, sir. Take him out, Rama. Smash him. Strike him down. Wow, that's so cool. That's so cool. I think Rama's my favorite summon. All right, so you're down. Now we gotta get this projector going. Okay, we're gonna use an Art of War on the projector. Use an ATB boost. 
No, it wasn't fast enough. All right, it's fine. Um, we'll do a high potion on you, Fee. Just heal up in this meantime. And now you're back. Ha, <laughs> friend, what a good friend. Don't attack the mist. Okay, so as a little like test, let's have Sonon do some fire on the right arm and see if that is immune, is immune. So ice, when I was attacking with ice. Okay, so maybe the whole thing is immune to fire. And the only reason I was seeing the immune thing pop up on the right arm is because Sonon has elemental materia linked with his fire materia. So his weapon has fire damage. So maybe Sonon's attacks are immune to the right. The right arm is immune to Sonon's attacks, but not to Yuffie's. That's my working theory. Uh, but I don't really know. Okay, let's use a banishment too, because we've got it. Well, if that's my working theory, let's equip ice again. Let's equip ice ninjutsu. I think we can do that. It says it's weak to ice. I think that's working. That's totally working. Okay, let's get locked onto that right arm. And you're doing your thing, and there's a Firaga coming. Dodge, 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 dodge. Ineffective dodging. Pinnacle drill. Really want to dodge that. Only kind of dodged it. Lock on. Okay. We're a frog again. Good. We'll just attack with our tongue. Fantastic. Okay. Center yourself, Brianna. You are clearly having issues. We're tired of this, clearly. Okay, so ice ninjutsu. Let's go. Then ice. You're about to attack me. Okay, you, you definitely were about to do that. We're synergized right now, which is fantastic. However, I really just need to cure. Use our ATB. We're gonna do an ensnare. You've ensnared me. Fantastic. I love it. You're, you keep disappearing, which makes it really hard for me to target that arm. Okay. We are synergized. We can do... Are we synergized? Yeah, why can't we do a synergized Art of War? There we go, okay, it just showed up. Okay, let's synergize Art of War on that right arm. Take it out. All right, here we go. ATB boost, can we do that? No, we can't. You know what? I really want to save some ATB for this projector thing. Oh, and Sonon's almost at a limit break, so let's unsynergize and hopefully just take it out while it's pressured. Great, now we have two full ATVs for this projector man. And what are we gonna use? We're gonna use, could use Icy Banishment, but I don't know if it's weak to ice. It's probably more likely weak to lightning. If we land our ninja cannonball, Sonon's ATV gets boosted. So maybe we'll do that. Okay, praying. We have to be synergized, Brianna. Into cannonball. Sonon now has an ATB, so I think he should use a Thundara, because it's a machine. I assume it's weak to lightning. Don't deploy the shield. It's too quick. The Thundara didn't land. Man. This guy is annoying. This guy is just annoying. Ay. All right, let's cure while we're here. Sonon it almost has his limit break at least, so. Cure on Yuffie. All right. Ay. Okay, you do your thing. You're in the Shadow Realm, ensnaring me. Okay, okay, we've done this five bajillion times. Nope, not the projector. Not the projector, we're locked onto the right arm, remember? Come on. 
god. Every time he unlocks... Oh my gosh, this is just... This is like a war of attrition here. Okay. Sonon has full ATB. Let's incite so we don't have to cure. And then Yuffie can just feel free to just syn synergize Art of War on the right arm. Let's do it. Great, he's crippled, fantastic. Okay, Yuffie will icy banishment, no. We'll switch to Lightning Ninjutsu. No, it's not even enough time. We'll do an Icy Banishment, finish Sky off. Okay, end Synergy. End Synergy and Sonon just immediately Limit Break. Please, please land. Please land. Woo, okay, that worked. Finally, oh my gosh, that took forever. Oh, that was exhausting. Oh, so focused, like my eyes are watering. Okay, sealed it. No problem, easy. And that's where we're going to end today's episode. I am so excited to see what's next. The combat has been super fun and so rewarding, even though I still don't feel like there are some things I've totally mastered or even know how to do at all, but I blunder my way through. You know, it's my first playthrough, who cares? Um, I'm having fun and I hope you are too. I hope it's entertaining for you, even if I'm not the combat master just yet, at least. Um, I don't know what to expect from spider arms guy, uh, straight jacket guy. I am excited to see what happens. Uh, he totally messed up those combat guys. I, I really feel bad. Um, but I'm excited to see what's next. So I feel like we're getting towards the end. Things are heating up. It's going to be great. Please leave me a comment. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know if you're still enjoying this and, um, if you're excited to see what's coming next. As always, I appreciate you all so, so much for watching. I appreciate your support. I appreciate every like, every comment, every follow on social media. Uh, just anyone who's along this journey, this crazy, crazy, crazy journey with me, I appreciate you so much. Uh, please remember to like the video if you enjoyed this video, share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course, please remember to subscribe to Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. That is all. I love you all. Bye.